check out these cool animated landing pages. And now let me show you how easy it is to make these landing pages. To begin with, I had this basic structure in my mind. Two buttons and animated SVG which will be the concept logo of the company and a concept company name. First we look at the hardest part which is the SVG. Now if you don't know SVG stands for scalable vector graphics and it is a vector image format. I created this SVG image in vector graphics editor called Inkscape. You can use any other graphics editor of your choice. But make sure that the final product is a SVG file. And for background I am using this space image that I created in Krita. Now once you have the SVG file you need to edit it and copy its source. Make sure that the SVG paths only have stroke property and have fill property as none. Because it's the strokes that will be animated. You also need to copy the SVG from the SVG start tag to the SVG end tag. This SVG source will go into your HTML file. Now let's look at our HTML file. Here we have the script tag for Vivas.js. Now Vivas.js is a JavaScript class and it is used for animating the SVG. For more details you can even check out Vivas.js on GitHub. This link to include Vivas.js is also available on GitHub via CDN.js. Next two are fonts from Google fonts and then we have the style sheet to bootstrap. Here you can see the two of our buttons and then our SVG tag starts. The height and width property of our SVG will determine the size of our SVG. Also remember the SVG's ID, we'll need it later. Then we have this text to display the concept name. Now this script tag is where all our animation starts. To create our animation, we just have to use this new Vivas.js syntax. Over here the first argument is the SVG ID. The second argument is the object with different animation options. Again these animation options are given in detail in their github page. The third argument is the callback function. It's the function that gets called when the animation is completed. For me the callback function that I have kept is used to make the buttons and the concept company name visible. Because I have set the visibility property of the button and text as hidden. Now this gives a nice effect where the button and text appears as soon as the animation is completed. Now let me show you how the animation looks with different type in the second argument. If this video was helpful then do drop a like. Thank you for watching and see you next time.